Hello everybody, and welcome to Nightmare Within. I am Bex, your cosy punk host, and I don't know if this counts as punk or cosy, I'm guessing it's leaning towards more the punk, it is maybe not the best descriptive word, but I was looking for something punny, and I got that and an incidental pun in that handle. I'm getting off track because uh, I don't like scary games. <laughs> I'm not good with scary games. If anyone's been watching my Amnesia series, they know what I'm talking about. I'm not good at scary games. It's also really quite loud, so I'm not sure how much of that you actually heard. So I pop it down to my favorite 75. 75. Yes, 75. Not 76. Not 74. 70, thank you. Just that sweet spot. Just that sweet spot. Sweet spot. Three out of four. Pain. Alright. Looks good. Looks good. Yes, 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 yes. Let's go. It looks really good, actually. The graphics look amazing. What the? Why is it so dark? Looks like the power is out. The power can't be out if your digital clock's on, mate. It must have gone off right. and then turned back on. Yeah. Oh, straight off the bat, we have, I a have to go down to the basement. Check the fuse box. Great. Oof. A little bit of lag, a little bit of camera wobble. Which flashlight. I'll take that. F to turn on flashlight. Okay. I'm not good at scary games. <laughs> okay, not physics based. To open the door, press and pull. Oh, it is physics based. Or at least the doors are. We have to open every door. It's a masterclass installing, don't you know? That is a cozy looking bed. Hey, I've got one of those. My wardrobe's too small, so I had to improvise and get one of these. Oh, please tell me that's not a hiding space. It's not. I can't fit. Great. Love it. I love not fitting. That's good. It's good to not be able to fit. Unless you do actually need to hide, in which case it's very bad that you don't fit. Pain away. Got a candelabra, that's nice. Unopenable drawers. Excuse me? What was that? Well, these won't, you won't be able to hide in those. It's quite awkward getting, there we go. Yeah, we'll check out that place in a minute. I wanna see what this is. Ironically enough, it's actually quite stormy where I live right now. Why are all our drawers empty? Why don't we have any stuff? Time to die? That's a real book. I gotta look this up. Okay. There is a book called Time to Die, but I don't think it's by Ben Omar, the one I'm thinking of. Man and His Woman. Oh, that's a bit weird. Okay, something creaked and it wasn't the floorboards. I 
I know we're supposed to go downstairs, but I ain't gonna. Not until we've done everything possible we can up here. Which includes, apparently, mostly just opening drawers. But not cupboards. Look at all the books. Look at all the detail on the books. Got two copies of Time to Die and Mountain. Three copies of Time to Die. Four. And a book that is literally just called Novels. This door won't go... This door won't open. Okay, never mind. Didn't want to go that way anyway. Guys, I really don't think I can do this. I really don't think I can do this. I hate scary games. If I was streaming it, at least I'd have chat. But I don't. I'm recording this and I'm spooked. These drawers I can't open. Wait, where did I come from? Okay, it was in there. Wait, was it? I'm already lost. Missing. Presses hold to zoom in. Why? Why would I want to do that? The person who said I should try this demo, they know who they are. Uh, thank you. I hate you. I don't want to do any of this. Also, it's night time. Why are all our books on the floor, but also why are all our curtains open? Who left the milk out? Who didn't eat their meatballs and spaghetti? I am using the zoom in a correct fashion. To zoom in on meatballs. What other reason is there to use zoom? I chicken out of scary games. I was playing Phasmo yesterday with a mate. And even with them there, I was like, I don't want to be here. <laughs> I would like to leave now, please. The basement door is open. I doubt. I lock it. 
<laughs> uh, nope. How long is this demo? Why are so many books on the floor? And why don't I care? Why aren't I going? Why are these all on the floor? Steve, Queen, Day and Night. Monkey. Two monkeys and one banana. For a title of that, that is a very thick volume. Piano! Whose idea was this? Okay. Stop moving my furniture without my permission. This is a really big house. Like, how am I here all alone? How do I live alone in this big ass house? This big ass spooky house with all its books on the floor. Take it, that's... Yes, it is, okay. We will go there, eventually, when I am good and ready, thank you very much. Why aren't I commenting on the weird noises? Is this literally just the other side of where I was? Possibly. It's nice that it all loops around, I suppose. My parents' house is a bit like that. I hate scary games. There is no molecule or particle or atom of my body that wants to do this. For the content. What the hell? The door just closed on its own. It was the wind. Thank you, wind, doing my job for me. Closing doors. Guys, it is entirely possible that I will die from heart failure, so, uh... I don't know. Per press F to pay respects, I guess. I hate everything about this. Alright. The fuses are in place. Just need to turn the power back on. Is that good? I think I prefer this place in the dark. Why did it make such a spooky noise? I mean, it is a scary game. Please let me out. <laughs> Guys, I really can't do this. I'm gonna die of heart failure. Is there another way out of here? Per chance? Maybe I'm supposed to zoom in on this. What am I supposed to do? I hate this. Please just let me out. supposed to be zooming in on something? Is something scary supposed to be happening and it just didn't trigger? I 
I genuinely don't know what I'm supposed to do now. Am I meant to be seeing something that's like scary and shouldn't be here and I'm just blind? So it feels like I'm being lulled into a full sense of security. Okay. Is that the door creaking open? Per chance? No, I could only be so lucky. Do I have like objectives? Am I just maybe screwing up the physics of trying to open the door at the top? But I don't think so. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Yep, that sure is a door handle. Okay. I don't seem that concerned. I'm just locked in my basement. I guess I'll just starve down here. No one will find me because I live alone in a gigantic house in the middle of a storm. I don't get it. Okay, I'm gonna... I think that's just ambience, but I guess we'll find out. It doesn't make any sense that I'd come all the way down here to turn my fuse back box on and then do it and then just switch it off. Did I just hear like something dripping? It really feels like I'm missing something. Ooh, spooky. Yeah, the fact that it's glowing red doesn't seem like a good thing, but... To move extremely slowly. That light isn't working. Why do we need to zoom in on things? Okay, guys, I'm kind of at a loss. Uh, this would probably be about where I'd stop, honestly. I guess this is just stuck in your basement simulator. And the basement doesn't actually seem that scary. So I guess this is Nightmare Within, but nothing seems to be within except me and my basement. The ambience is pretty good, even though it doesn't seem to actually indicate anything. The door physics could do with a little work because it's a bit confusing. Like how am I supposed to open this? Are you fucking serious? Oh, hi. Okay, so this is something I, I just didn't open the door properly because of course I didn't. Um, this is something I do in, in scary games because it's easier than waiting for something scary to happen. Is I'm just gonna bum rush this guy. Um, okay, let's go. <laughs> what was that? 
<laughs> well, that was fun. We got a s spooky, spooky ghost just hanging out in our in our house. The thing is, the house loops. So the spooky, spooky ghost could be coming right up behind me. Can't believe it. I couldn't open the door. Actually, no, I can't absolutely believe that. Hello, spooky ghost. I love the fact that it's a sheet ghost, by the way. Not just because that is just like the OG stereotypical traditional ghost. Where is that? coming from. Honestly, I'm feeling much better now that things have actually got moving. I'm also getting a bit screen tearing, but okay, well, don't need to go in there ever again. More floorboards? I'm pretty sure it wasn't like that before. Okay. No spooky ghosts here. The music box has actually gotten quieter as well. You're probably supposed to find that. go in oh <laughs> is this a joke are you insane no it's not a joke the house is getting more decrepit by the way go home now. Andrew Toxic. Oh, kitty poster. Did we kill our daughter? Is that what this is? A drawing from my favorite mom. I tried my best. It's a really good drawing. Also, your favorite mom? I suppose it is possible you could have another. This seems like something I should really be able to pick up. Yeah, I have a hairbrush like that. Can't use it right now because, uh... Okay... Don't like that. Oh. My mom often punishes me and I hide from her in the closet. Sometimes my dad is afraid of her too. Great. 
Oh no. I was so happy earlier when we couldn't get in the closet. Fuck you. Mom said that one day my drawings would be seen by everyone. And if they didn't want to, mom would make them see them. I have a boy at school with a bag on his head. He says he's afraid of his face. Do we have to touch that? These drawings are so strange. Looks like they belong to the previous residence. I hate this. I just want to get in the closet and stay there. The fact that it keeps closing is really annoying. Okay, so I'm just gonna... Wait, how... Okay. I'm expecting... I really don't want to play this, guys. I don't know if you could figure that out, but... I just really, really, really would rather not. No! Hard no! No! I don't want to do this! Okay. Freaking out. Go away. Go away. I think I recognize the this house. It's been used in another game. Okay, part two. fan of the door of physics. Makes an already stressful situation that much more stressful. I don't remember where the phone is. It's right there. I don't like it. Is someone here? This guy, I don't know who he is, but he's like the most chill person considering everything we've seen so far. Like, how is he not completely the freak, freak the fuck out?
I like the colored lamps are places where it's like leading us somewhere maybe. Maybe we can just go back to bed. Maybe that's an option. God, why is this room so big? For future hiding. It is a nice house. Shame it's fucking haunted. Difficult to know what we're supposed to do and where we're supposed to go. Meatballs still look good though, and someone still left the milk out. Why would I want to do that? Oh, I don't like the fact that that is a mechanic. Don't like that at all. Can we open our fridge? Nope. Well, we got some perfectly good meatballs to. It looked like there was something growing on the outside of the door. Maybe it'll keep us in. I'm not sure. That rhymed. Okay, that's just the basement. We don't need to go in there ever again. Ever. Again. Ever. living rooms. I feel like this is where it wants us to go because this is where the spooky ghost was. Yeah. That is the problem with the house being a loop. That's still the basement. I just keep seeing an open door and think, oh, it's rather a closed door and thinking, we need to open that. back in here. It's not quite what I intended. Okay, the ambience is good, but it's also a bit confusing because sometimes the door creaking is actually a door creaking open. Other times it is just the ambience and it's a little bit difficult to tell the difference between the two. And the fact that the house loops means it's really difficult to figure out where we're supposed to go next and we end up just going around in literal circles. I do, however, like the spookiness. I like the scares. I like the sheet ghost. I think it's a very good way of actually doing that. Because most people think, oh, someone wearing a sheet, that ain't scary. But in this setting, it kind of is. There's someone in my house. They could be wearing fucking anything. And this, this was the spooky door, but can't still can't open it. At least I think it was the spooky door. Also, like, not 
knowing what our character's motivation is, like what we're supposed to do next. I know I understand it's a demo, but it would be nice just to understand what it actually wants from us. Do you want me to be spooked? We've done a pretty good job of that so far, but right now I'm just kind of confused because I don't know where we're supposed to go next. I do think the, the coloured lights have something to do with it, but I couldn't tell you what. And so the phone rung, but then we couldn't pick it up. Okay. Phone rang, I should say, not rung. I really don't know where I'm supposed to go next. I'm gonna go da back down the date basement because it's one of the few doors that are actually unlocked. Everything else seems to be locked. I can't seem to figure out what's supposed to be next. I don't think we're supposed to be back down here, but. Also, a nice sort of symbol on locked doors might be a good indicator of whether or not we can actually open them because the physics mechanic makes it a bit difficult to tell because you can push it, you can pull it, but you have to be at a certain angle to do either and it's a little... Like, I almost got stuck in the basement because I just wasn't getting the right angle to do the physics. Are we meant to try and just leave? No, won't even let us touch the out the outside doors. I think I just got spooked by dust mates. That's where the ghost was last. Yeah, can't can't go outside. It's meant to be something here. The room with the pictures was pretty cool, but we can't go back in there now the door's locked. <gasps> okay. Jeez, how long was she just sitting there? I turned the wrong way. Nice stripy tights. Well, that's a bit weird. Guessing. Yeah, locked. Shocking. Oh, it's a puzzle. Okay, great. I suck at puzzles. Uh, okay. Oh yay, bathrooms. That's a favorite for horror games. And horror things. Okay, I object. I vehemently object. No, 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 no. How doth I escape? Oh! You shouldn't have moved here. Okay. I mean, thanks for letting me know. I guess. Can 
Can I go now? You know, I can leave. You can just, like, let me leave. I mean, it's a big house. I shouldn't be living here all by my lonesome anyway. You're not gonna live here. Oh, it changed. Does that mean I'm gonna die here? Ooh. Wait, hold on. Ooh. Then can I just go? The power is not working. No, 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 no. Come on. Turn on. Why is sorry, sorry night upside down? <laughs> Fuck. What the hell is that? I would like to go home now. My actual home, because this ain't it. Oh, hi. I love a nice piano. Let's just listen to him play for a bit. Just listen to him play for a bit. shocked by that. I accidentally turned my torch off and <laughs> I've been right clicking furiously to turn it back on even though that's uh, phasmo controls. <laughs> Why are there so many bathrooms in this house? I didn't realize it had footsteps before. That's Oh. No, no, no. I don't want to remember this. <gasps> Bum rush it. Okay, that's worse somehow. Oh no. No, 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 not that sound. Not that sound, please. Any sound but that one. Any sound but that one. <sighs> this is insane. Yeah, yeah, yeah it is. Oh, hello haunted wheelchair. Lovely to see you as always. Oh! Okay. Thank you for playing. This demo was created by me alone and I truly appreciate your time and attention. I hope you enjoyed this glimpse into the world of Nightmare Within. This is just the beginning and there's much more mystery and horror to come. David Pankoff. Thank you. That was actually extremely effective. It had some moments where I feel like it could have just been me getting lost and just not noticing things because boy am I famous for that but there were some moments where it was a little bit unclear what area I was supposed to go next or what exactly I was supposed to do and I did kind of brute force your puzzle but that's kind of how I treat most puzzles but thank you everybody for watching if you enjoyed that and you like the look of it please go check out the game on Steam wishlist it maybe check out the demo yourself and uh I'm done. I'm going to go now. Okay, bye.